Miami has a dolphin, the greatest football team. We take the ball from goal to goal like no one's ever seen. We're in the air, we're on the ground. Third down and ten, Dalton in his own end zone, and down he goes into the safety. Ball game. It is. Dolphins win. Okay, the football right now is in front of the goal line, right there. Then he tucks it, and it crosses the plane of the goal line. The ruling on the field is confirmed. Yep, it's over. What's going on? It's your boy, OD the GM. And we here at Thursday Night Football, Bengals Dolphins at Paul Brown Stadium. Big Thursday night game. Big early season Thursday night game. About to kick off week four. You understand? And let's get right into the injury report. I mean, the injury report, rough. Dolphins got like 15 guys on the report. You know, including Tua, Armstead, X. Robert Hunt, Melvin Ingram, Brandon Jones, Jalen Waddle, and Javon Holland. Just name a few. I won't get too much into it. You know what I mean? And the Bengals got like nine guys as well. You know, but none of us can cry. Like Bills fans and the talking heads on on, on ESPN and NFL Network. Who don't want to give the Dolphins their props? You understand? We ain't crying. We ain't making no excuses. You understand? Right now, our offense, kind of the best offense we got going so far. We are 27.7 points a game right now. And we holding the opposite op opposition to 21.3 points a game. While the Bengals right now are averaging 21.3 points a game. You know, and they're holding their teams to 18.3 points a game. So their defense is playing pretty well. But their offense has yet to come alive. Hopefully, this ain't the game for them to come alive. Neither. Both teams explosive, though. You know, we got some real explosive receiving cores. And they won't lay their claim it's the best in the NFL. They got some pretty good receivers led by Jamar Chase. And he leads them at 212 yards per game. You know, the LSU, MLSU boys, they, they put up big numbers. And Waddle right now leading the Dolphins with 342 yards a game. And Hill right behind him with 317. Both offenses could get down the field. They could put up some numbers. You understand? And... and we ain't getting into no running games because the two of these running games right now, you know, they ain't saying nothing. You know, they ain't worth mentioning right now. Cincinnati now started the season not the way we thought they would. But they look like they had a Super Bowl hangover until they ran into the Jets. And I, I don't know when, when they can get on track, but... This ain't the week for them to get on track. I might as well tell you all now. You know, they paid a lot for this offensive line to keep Joe Burrow upright. They spent something like 80-something million this year. I think that's the number. Somewhere around there just to keep Joe Burrow upright. And they ain't working. You know, they ain't spend that much on players. And, and some coach ain't going to get fired midseason if this continue. You understand? So, someone got off the beat, that could be on the job and block. And they, they, they lead, they tie for league lead in sacks allowed, along with Washington. 15 sacks allowed for the season. That's five sacks a game. And I see five more coming Thursday. You understand? So, with that said, right, can they beat us? Can the Cincinnati Bengals at home? Beat the Dolphins. 
who, by the way, the Dolphins have owned them the past, what, 30 years, something like that. I don't know, I, I don't have my hands on what the numbers are, but we own them. So, can they beat us? Sure. Any given Sunday, Monday, or Thursday, sometimes a Saturday, a team could win. Will they beat us? Nope. They ain't beating us. But I feel our defense is going to be a little tired. And it may come down to Hill and Waddle getting down the field a lot. And Tua has already came out and said he's going to hit Tyreek every chance he get. Because Tyreek had something to say to Eli Apple and this is going to be a night. Do not miss this game. Do not. Final score on this one, 35-31. Dolphins. Okay, that's my prediction. That's what's going on this week. See boy OD the GM. We can link.